We spend millions of dollars to put these productions together. But to put all that together and then pick a day that you're going to present it before an audience for our first preview can be one of the most stress-induced comas that I've ever been a part of. 15 minutes, ladies and gentlemen, this is your 15-minute call. 15 minutes till the top of the show, 15 minutes. Thank you. My name is Scott Anderson. I'm the artistic director, and this is opening night for Shrek. None of this works out here unless you can tell a good story. And it really does begin with the story. We are rehearsing two major musicals at the same time. Shrek, Newsies, Mamma Mia, and you have the same cast for all three. How does that work? But, you know, in order to tell you our story, we, we probably got to give you the backstory. And it wouldn't have started without somebody with a big dream. I saw this glorious backdrop of red rocks and thought, amphitheater, you know, it's made for it. He saw that canyon filled with tulacon. I didn't see that. He knew that it had a magic spell in it and that he wanted people from all over to discover how beautiful this place was. There's something really big and important about this place and what's going to happen here. There's a vibration here that you can feel and the shows are charged with that. We're able to tell a story for two and a half hours where people can come and escape the world. We have the canyon back there as a backdrop for all the shows. I remember driving up and I was like... I was hearing music and singing and applause. We only had to move 12 inches of dirt to put the seats in. That amphitheater's been there for a million years. If you stay true to what you've done in the rehearsal room, the adrenaline should be a positive thing because it excites you to show it off. This show is huge. I've been calling it the show that ate New York. You have to be 100% every night for every show for a live audience. There's nothing like live theater. There's absolutely nothing like it.